this is Kara, aka the Principal Painter, and this evening I am coming at you with some never before seen items from none other than Craftably. I was able to go to Fort Worth uh, day before yesterday with Marlon, and we had a wonderful time with Michael. Saw their new office, saw their new warehouse and also got to hear about some plans that they have for putting some of these items on, well, all of these items actually, on their website. These items that I'm about to show you, this is the first time anybody is getting able, uh, is being able to see them because they are not yet on the website. Michael has said in the next few days they will be coming on the website, so if you are interested in any of these items, uh, keep checking the Craftably website because they will be on there and there's some awesome things coming down the pike at Craftably. So let me show you. Uh, this is part one of a two-part series that I'm going to do because I've got some other items to show you as well uh, that are new, new, new items to Craftably. Love Craftably, love everything they represent. I am an affiliate with Craftably. And uh, if you would like to, on your first purchase, you can get 15% off of your first purchase from Craftably by using the coupon code Painter10 in the discount code box. So, excuse me, Painter15, Painter15, sorry. So use Painter15 in the discount code box for 15% off if you are purchasing for the first time from Craftably. All right, let's get into this, shall we? All right, the first item they are going to have up for grabs on their website. I love this. All right, this is an entire kit that they're going to have on their site. First of all, they have oodles and oodles of these awesome bags. Yes, I said oodles. That's a Kara-ism. And they are heavy duty. They are Ziploc bags. And um, they also have holes uh, on the top of them. So if you want to kit up this way, if you want to store drills in these, whatever you need to do, like I said, it is a kit. You can use it in whatever way you want to. Uh, you can put your drills in here. It also comes with three rings. And these rings come apart very easily. All you have to do is uh, twist them, pull them apart. There we go. And you can put the bags, uh, you know, the the metal ring through the holes in the bags. And then when you are ready to use a, a specific color, you've got them here, you can flip them up and flip them back and use the bags that you would like. So that is an awesome thing. I have not kitted up this way, but you know what? It's worth a try, so I may, I may do that. In addition in this kit, you get 10 sheets of labels. Um, and they're uh, the longer labels. They will fit uh, on just about any container system that you have to kit up. So that is awesome. I always need these labels for different things when I'm kitting up. You also get two trays. And again, they are the uh, plastic trays and they do have the funnels so that you, that you can pour your drills uh, back into the containers very, very easily. So I thought that was a pretty cool kit. You get a ton of stuff in here and um, you know, it's stuff that's very useful and I love these Ziploc bags. They you know, obviously are reusable and obviously you can use the labels that are in here. I believe there are gonna be 10 sheets of labels uh, if I'm not mistaken and um, Great, great kit to have just, again, for accessories and everything that you might need for those types of things. I am super excited about this item. They are going to start carrying metal tips. They will carry gold as these are. They will carry silver and they will carry rose gold. And what you will get, you will get a baggie of these tiny, can they see these tiny little uh, washers? And that is to put around the ends of these metal tips so that they don't slide out of your pen. Um, this is awesome. And again, I got the gold, but they do come in silver and rose gold. Uh, in these, uh, in these tip, little tip kits, you get a seven placer, you get a one placer, you get a curved one placer. Guys, if you've used a curved one placer like this, let me know in the comments below. I haven't, but I'm gonna try it out. You get a straightener, awesome, and you get a four placer, which is obviously my jam. So great, great um, tips and uh, drill straightener in this little kit. So again, they will start carrying the metal tips, guys. That's exciting, I love mine. Use them all the time. What else did I get? They are going to start carrying these 
gorgeous acrylic pens. Uh, they do come with a variety of tips. Let me get this open. Sorry, guys. Struggling. The struggle is real here. But look at this beautiful... I saw actually two pens uh, in their warehouse. Get all these tips out here. These are the plastic tips, but that is okay. Those These are great, too. Um, you can switch out your metal tips for your plastic tips. I believe I got everything out of that bag. But look how beautiful this pen is. And it is a thicker pen, but it's not too thick. I love this thickness of pen. And I got a blue and green swirled one. They have, they will have glittered pens, all kinds of things. And look at all these tips, guys. Again, you get, uh, what is this one? Does it say? I believe it is a three placer. You get a single placer. Ooh, you also get, look at this, you get a silver uh, metal single placer. That's awesome. It already has the washers on it. Fantastic. A plastic single placer that is curved. That's the one I want to find out about because I have not used one of those. A, a straightener. A, just don't have the numbers on it. I will guess this is a seven placer and this looks like maybe a 10 blazer. Anyway, you can place a lot of drills with that. They are the thin plastic kind, which I absolutely love. And all of those come in with your pen, which is awesome. Normally when you buy pens like this, you'll get a couple, but you get all of these placers with the pen. And I think that is amazing. And again, guys, don't look tonight on their website. These items are not going to be on their website tonight, but they will be there within the next few days. So how is everybody doing on this Sunday evening? I hope you're doing well. And as I always do, I'm throwing things around here. There you go. And in goes the straightener. All right. What else? What else are they going to have, Kara? What else? What else? They will have. Oh, I love these. He pulled, Michael pulled these out and I went nuts because I always use these. These are your uh, papers and they will go down on your diamond painting uh, to either block it off if you want to section off your uh, diamond painting. You can put these release papers down. The great thing about these is sometimes on this release paper there's a shiny side and a dull side and you have to put a sticker on the dull side so you don't stick it down on your canvas and make a mess. Both sides of this release paper have the shiny material on it, so you can place it down on either side without worrying about which side you're placing down. So uh, that is an awesome feature. And look at look at all. I mean, seriously, look at how many release papers you get. I have not counted them, but that is quite a few. And I know um, those of you that use release papers, actually, I was talking to my bestie, Brandy of Mystery of Diamonds. She uses release papers on all of her diamond paintings. And what she says is, after a while, your release papers kind of stop working. So it's nice to have extras. And uh, when you get these release papers, you will definitely have extras to use many, many times. So that is a ton. I would say at least 50 to 60 release papers you get in there. So that's fabulous. All right. They are also, guys, gonna start carrying. And I'm I'm motivated, guys. This has been hard for me, but I'm going to try it. They are carrying miniatures, guys. These are coming in. This one I got was holiday party time. It just looks like a big birthday party's going on. I love the palm tree. They're all little pastries and things that you can make with this miniature kit. And they have many miniature kits that, again, they are getting in. This is another item that's going to be listed on their website. So if you are a miniatures person, they are coming. I'm super excited about this. So, yes, I will be uh, attempting this. Wish me luck. All right. I'm going to set this down here to the side. Also, I love this. Many of you have seen these, but this has a different feature. So they are going to start carrying. They already do carry these uh, zipper cases that uh, have beautiful designs on them. I got kind of a swirled paint look on mine. Um, and we are used to the round cylinder containers that go in these. And, they, and Craftably has carried these for a while with the round cylinder containers. Check this out. This one not only has your netting, your labels for the containers. These, I love these containers, guys. 
These are the large Tic Tac containers. Um, I'm not really a fan of the skinny Tic Tac containers, but I love these large Tic Tac containers because you can get the drills in and out of them very nicely. Uh, they have the flip lids that help you pour your drills into your trays very nicely. I love the large size Tic Tac containers. Six, nine. So 54 of the Tic Tac containers, the large Tic Tac containers go in this case. So that is a new feature uh, with these cases that I am super excited about. Ah, oh, yay. And I love the case. It is a very sturdy case. You can travel with it, what have you. And it's got the netting, so you can put a diamond painting pen in here. You can put you know, any needed um, items in here to diamond paint, zip it up, and you are good to go. Love that. Thank you so much, Michael. Again, check out the website in the next few days. These will be on it as well. I do have an unboxing for you as well. Are you guys ready for this? These are the new Craftably boxes. I'm going to cover up the image and show you the new boxes. Remember, they stopped doing the tubes. Now, will they still have tubes? Absolutely, they will have tubes. Um, Michael is contemplating the prices on these tubes uh, if you buy a tube separately or buy a tube with a kit. But all the kits will come in a box. These are the new boxes. Wanted to show you. It says Craftably DIY Kit Premium Diamond Painting. I'm trying to cover up the image. You probably already saw it. On the side, it says, you know, it's got uh, the brand on it. And on the back, I love this. It talks about what is diamond painting, easy as peel, stakes, shake, stick. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm combining words here. Um, kit features, and look, it's got a picture of Amy. She's the Craftably wife. This is my, uh, Michael's wife, Amy, and co-owner of Craftably. So I, that, was, that made me smile to see her beautiful face on this box. Also, it talks about their tool kit. They're, all of their tool kits come in this beautiful bag. Uh, kind of looks like burlap, but it's softer than burlap. You get your diamond painting tips. You get your tweezers. Uh, you do get a pen. I don't see a pen on here, but you do get a pen. You get uh, a pot full of wax, washi tape, and a cover minder. The washi tape and cover minders will be different in each of the tool kits. You do get a plastic boat with a funnel. So it's everything you're going to need to diamond paint. So, um, and again, they have what is in the... Um, what is in the toolkit. So that is awesome. And it says, sorry, I got to represent born in Texas. Yes. Sorry. I'm a Texas girl. You know that. Well, I won't apologize, but those are the new boxes and they are beautiful. What diamond painting did I get? I just got finished. Uh, I completed one and I will do a post review on it. I just completed Windswept from Jasmine Beckett Griffith. It turned out beautifully. I will be doing a post review on that. Uh, showed a picture of the completed kit to Michael. He hadn't seen that one uh, completed, so I was glad to be able to show him that one. I had to get another JBG, guys. I had to. I loved this one. This one is called Paisley. So on your new Craftably boxes, you will get a big sticker and look at the size of that image. You can really see it well. I just love it. Can you see it now? All right. So she, I love the colors in this. She's got the rainbows. I love rainbows. Look at her beautiful face and the flowers in her hair. I had to get it. I have not opened it. It is a 20 by 28 inch round. Let me see. Can I get this? I cannot get my measuring tape out. I'm going to struggle with this. Okay, um, so 20 by 28 inch round. So I need to convert that to centimeters, but let's get this out. So your box will come in uh, cellophane. Uh, they are still working on that design, but let's see what you get. All right, the box down. Here, again, is one of their beautiful toolkits. I love these bags. These bags are very eco-friendly. You can use them again and again for different types of things in addition to carrying what is in your toolkit. Look at this beautiful washi tape they put in two rolls. That's beautiful. One has kind of a chevron. One looks like a scallop, and they're beautiful colors. Love it. 
This is your pot of craftably wax. Love it because again, it keeps your wax from drying out. Remember, when you are getting ready to diamond paint, there is plastic on the top and bottom of this wax. Peel the wax off or once again, you will get no wax in your pen. But put it back in this little pot because again, it keeps it from drying out and you get a cover minder. Oh, this is cool. I haven't seen this. Okay, this is taped up. I'm going to struggle a moment. Let me get my melon machete out. I think I got it. Let's see. Okay, it's really secure in here. Come on, come out. Really? Okay, I'm gonna cut myself. Okay, let's see if that worked. Help, help, I can't get it. Urgh. <laughs> okay, Marlon is saying move on. I'm gonna try one more time. Oh, cut yourself. I know, I'm gonna cut myself. Well. Okay, you're not gonna have to watch me struggle all day for a cover minder. Um, this looks like a game playing piece. Can they see that? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a green, it looks like a little game playing piece if you're playing a game to mark your place on the game. So that is adorable. I don't have one like that and I love that color green. Sorry, I was not gonna make you watch me struggle for 12 hours. You also get another uh, eco-friendly bag. This one is another uh, bag that has got nice thick plastic. Love that. And in your toolkit, you will get a diamond painting pen. It is very sparkly. Single placer, four placer. You also get a couple more placers. You get a seven placer and an additional four placer. So that is very helpful. Um, if this uh, if this happens to break or you're a hard presser, sometimes I do that, so you have an extra one there. Um, you also get a squishy for diamond painting comfort, so you don't hurt your hand while you're diamond painting. If you're a hard presser like me, that is very convenient. You get a plate of wax. You get a plastic boat with a funnel, and uh, that helps pour your drills in, and you get tweezers. These are the pointy, stabby tweezers. Please keep the sheath on them. Keep them away from small children and do not poke your eyeball out. All right, so that's what comes in your Craftably Toolkit. Let me get all this put to the side or else we will not be able to see the painting. So yes, it was a great trip to Craftably. We got to go out and have lunch. Oh, we had lunch at the best place. Michael suggested this Hawaiian chicken place and it was delicious. We had a great lunch. Marlon loved it. I loved it. It was so much fun. And again, just so great to see Michael. Um, Craftably is a family owned business. They are second to none. I, again, will sing their praises to the rooftops uh, every single time. Their canvases. Let me talk to you about their canvas before I roll it back. It does have some tape on it, but it's not gonna impact your canvas at all. You just peel that tape right off and you're done with that. The canvases have a very felty feel to the back of them. They are scalloped and surged to prevent fraying. Never had a problem with, with a craftably um, canvas at all. Let me roll this back. This is poured glue, so you are able to Roll it back. If it does have a white cover on it, do not do it. You could ruin your canvas. So I'm gonna roll this back. These canvases are self-flattening and they will self-flatten for you without having to roll them back, but I do it just because I wanna show you all of the goodies and let the canvas flatten out and you roll it back and you zhuzh, zhuzh, zhuzh. Ooh, I am already seeing gorgeous colors. <gasps> Ooh, so exciting. Okay, those are the drills. What else do you get rolled up in your canvas? You get directions and a welcome from Craftably on uh, diamond painting. It talks about the contents of your kit, how to diamond paint, step-by-step uh, -step instructions, and on the back, what your new kit features. And again, welcome to the Craftably family. Uh, that is really nice, so you know everything that you get in your kit. You also get this large sticker sheet. I love this. This, these are all extra stickers that you can, you know, obviously I've got a ton of stickers on my crafting table here, but these are just because stickers. So they're extra that they send you. This is your log book sticker where you can put your start and end date. The name of this, I've forgotten to tell you this. This is Paisley. 
Uh, so that is awesome. And she is a round kit and 20 by 28 inches. Craftably does put their dimensions in inches. These stickers, you can, um, they are pre-cut, so you can peel them off and put them on your containers to kit up with. There are 61 colors. Looks like, are you ready? Because this is a round kit, you are going to get crystals in it. In the round kits from Craftably, you do get crystals. So you get one AB and it looks like three crystals, and I will be showing you those momentarily. So that, again, this whole thing is a big sticker sheet. I love this. I sweat glitter. <laughs> okay. Are you ready to see her? I am ready to see her. Oh my gosh, these colors, guys. I love purples and blues. This is right up my alley. Oh my gosh. Look at her beautiful face. I love everything about this. I love this. This looks like a little bit of a nest made out of deer antlers, maybe. I don't know. Her hands are in the nest. That is so pretty. But this is Paisley, and you can see from the swirly designs around her why she is. Uh, it's called Paisley. You do have schematics on the top left and bottom right. You do have on the bottom right a thumbnail and the dimensions of the, uh, the dimensions of the image and on the bottom, you do have, again, uh, you have the title of the painting, a thumbnail by Jasmine Beckett Griffith. Is Jasmine Beckett Griffith licensed through Craftably? Absolutely, she is. Craftably legally licenses all of their artists, which is extremely important. And the top of your canvas is branded. So let me peel this back and we'll check out the canvas. I love this cover paper. The plastic is nice and thick. I love it. Very sticky canvas. Marlin, pan, can you pan them into this canvas so they can see how clear it is? I have never had a problem with a craftably canvas. Very light um, writing on darker colors, darker colors, or darker writing on lighter colors. So that is awesome. And all these symbols are extremely clear. I am looking. Yeah, I'm, I'm seeing them even without glasses. So just absolutely beautiful. Love this. I'm going to say this again. If you see anything that appears to be rivers and bubbles, it's just the plastic cover. It is not, uh, it has nothing to do with the canvas. The canvas is always just perfection. I just, and I, again, I love this plastic. It's really, really nice. All right, let's flip her over and check out the colors. I will not take 10 hours on the colors. Another thing that they do at Craftably is they do label the bags of drills in case you store your drills separately from your paintings as I do. It's got a, I love it that it has a picture of the image as well. So that's awesome. And they put the sticker on so I didn't tear it. Okay, let's look. All right, here we go. A, Bs, and crystals are coming first. So here is your first, well, here is your only A, B. The rest are crystals. Kara. What is an AB drill? AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It is a special coating put on the drills to capture facets of light and color and captures, again, the colors of the drills around it and the environment around it and just makes them all together now. Shim, shim, shimmy, shimmer. Just a little bit more. That is a beautiful green. Can they see that coating? Mm -hmm. All right, then we've got some rhinestones. Like I said, round kits from Craftably do contain rhinestones beautiful blue, a beautiful golden, it's kind of a cross between gold and orange and yellow. So I'm just seeing a lot of that in there. And then a beautiful red crystal. When I was doing windswept, the crystals just made it. It was gorgeous. All right, I'm going to lay out the color palette. I'm not going to make you sit here for 12 hours. So I'm just going to let you see the colors. I'm going to try to keep them in order. I always mess them up. Just lay them out here. So you can see them. They are numbered, which is super nice. Love that. Okay, can I count? <laughs> Nine, ten, there you go. All right. Oh, I'm doing this from the back, so I'm getting confused. Sorry, guys. Look at all of these beautiful colors. I just love them. You're gonna have some nature color. Oh, beautiful oranges. I mean, check these out. They're gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. 
Lots of colors here, guys. Sorry. 24, 25, some browns for that nest. 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Lots of colors in here, guys. 57 colors. So it's going to take me a little bit. Just hang on. And I'm going to have to get them out of num numerical order so that you can see them all. Just a beautiful color palette. I'm going to start setting some up, some up here. For those of you that um, are screaming right now because you're OCD like me, I know, I'm sorry. But in order for you to see all these beautiful colors, I have to kind of get them where you can see them. So can they see all these? Marlon, can they see all these? Ooh, look mm -hmm. at these pretty blues. Ooh. Oh, look at this blue. I love that blue. That's gorgeous. Okay, more turquoises, more taupes. All right, so there is your color palette, folks. You've got some nature colors because she's out in nature, and you also have some beautiful, vibrant colors that are just going to pop on that painting. Just love it. I want to know where those ABs go, and I want to know where those, those crystals go. So that's your color palette. Let me move this off to the side. I promise I will put them all back where they go. And for Kara, more things going on the floor. That's okay. I'll get it. All righty. So, I have to be a little, little bit careful. Okay, so your first AB is going to be a U, and I'm already seeing it. This light green all in here is going to be U. There's some U's over here. There are U's up here in these swirls. That's where your AB is gonna go. There's gotta be some, yes, there's some U's right here in these leaves. Can they see? I'm sorry, I hope I'm not blocking them. There's some U's down here, around in here, and at the bottom. So that's where your U, uh, your AB is gonna go. Your first crystal looks to be two little sideways dots. Okay, you have some down here in the outlining the flowers. Any more sideways dots? Yes, okay. Up here, outlining what appears to be a butterfly. Um, let me see, any more sideways dots? I'm looking. Doesn't appear to be any more, but I just wanna check and make sure. Uh-uh, I don't see any more. Are there, are there any in her eyes, I'm wondering? Nope, but that doesn't mean you can't replace. Look at all the beautiful colors in her eyes. So many colors. Okay. The next crystal, that cross between a gold and a yellow and an orange. You've got some down here in the flowers. You have some over here appear to be in her wings. You have a lot going in here in these leaves. Oh, look at all this. You've got all, all of these yellow swirls. That's all going to be those crystals all going in there. Any, any, basically, anywhere you see that bright yellow is going to be that, uh, that particular crystal. And the last one is the letter L. It is that beautiful blue crystal. I am shocked I don't see any in her eyes. I don't, but again, you can replace um, diamond painting with sparklers. You certainly can. Where is the letter L? I'm looking. Ah, here we go. Um, some outlines in here in the swirls. Any other L's? Sorry guys, I have old eyes. All this outline of this swirl is L. Um, over here in the blue, the L's are sprinkled in here. Um, 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 um. Any up here? Nope, I don't see any more L's. I'm looking, looking, looking. Nope, don't see any more L's. So that's where your crystals are going to go. Uh, but like I said, if you want to replace with even more bling on this canvas, you certainly can do it. Um, sparklers, diamond painting with sparklers is your place to go. Uh, Tina Bernie, Tima is actually doing a collab this month uh, where people are replacing some drills in their canvases with uh, her sparklers. So uh, 
feel free. That's the art of this on any of these canvases. If you want to replace or you see someplace that might need a little extra zing, you can certainly do that. So um, that is what I've got for you tonight, folks. I know this video is a little bit long, but I wanted to show you some of the great products that Craftably is coming out with. Keep looking on their website. Uh, their pre-orders, I asked Michael, some of you have asked me about this. Their pre-orders should be coming in any day. They're waiting. Um, again, China's having some shipping stuff. They've had to close China down once again due to that nasty virus. Uh, but uh, please be patient. They are uh, hoping for the pre-orders to get in at any, any time now. So that's exciting. I do have some pre-orders out there myself. All right, guys, that's what I've got for you. Go check out Craftably's website. Check out the new items coming in. Thank you so much, Craftably, for letting me show all these awesome items. I have loved showing them. I think I dropped the pen on the floor. Sorry. <laughs> Ugh. Again, it wouldn't be a Kara video without dropping on the floor. I will leave you with this. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. This is the Principal Painter, and I am signing off.